Hi, welcome to the next channel. So recently I have done this uh, uh, picture and then I have published in the Toffee Project uh, website. As you can see here, it's all about its uh, ecosystem and the big picture to make something uh, like uh, you know toffee data center or toffee you need uh, various uh, you know components uh, you need uh, some testing tools you need uh, uh, research education and stuff like that so so somewhat about uh, the same i have discussed more in depth in one of my uh, previous video episodes over here uh, which is all about uh, some faq of uh, uh, Riverbed and Silver Peak versus uh, <laughs> and van optimization framework like a Toffee data center. So in that I have discussed uh, uh, you know quite in depth about the ecosystem. So by that way, if you see here, uh, there are various tools which I have done uh, so that I can do uh, you know uh, uh, you know testing and as well as I can use these tools in terms of development of uh, a Toffee data center. And one such important tool is uh, Toffee Mocha. as you can see there so with the toffee poka i do uh, you know various scenarios i can do van emulation i can uh, simulate uh, some kind of a uh, mobile uh, uh, network or wireless networks i can do uh, simulations like uh, 5g network and <laughs> stuff like that i can do even in flight wifi i can do some uh, simulations like satellite networks and uh, all this unique cases so beyond which uh, i need uh, a precise tool where in which uh, we can able to send uh, packets uh, test packets so you have various choices for the same you can download some online tools and then you can generate the packets and uh, i'm not talking about uh, something like using like ixia because uh, it is not something uh, which is uh, feasible in my case so ixia is uh, as you know it is quite expensive commercial product and moreover the objective for me is not about uh, uh generating these packets in uh, some kind of you know wire speed performance so the objective is quite different i need a tool where i can send a precise amount of you know packets so with this uh, objective in place you can uh, generally write your own code and you can send on a typical linux system but the problem with the same is as long as you have um, you know ethernet ports or network ports with ip address associated with the same you may get lot of background noise like you see here see uh, as you see here uh, this is at uh, wireshark capture which is uh, running in the background and i'm not running any active applications other than this uh, you know firefox but still you can get lot of you know background noise so this is what something which we never need on a precise you know testing scenario we need a very precise uh, uh, tool uh, where uh, we, uh, you know you can configure you can uh, configure uh, uh, it to send uh, like 1 million packets 1 billion packets or so and you can also adjust the rate of these packets and uh, you can do various other things so, sometimes you can you can send the complete junk data and this can be used to test any uh, cp uh, vulnerabilities of any network appliance because in case if some packet comes which looks like by chance it looks like a genuine packet but it has some kind of offset uh, you know tlv values or something and uh, uh, you know th there are uh, Uh, possible cases uh, it may take these packets and then it will try to interpret uh, and parse these packets and interpret these packets and uh, those parsers may fail and it may end up <laughs> crashing that uh, you know a specific application or the entire system uh, and this is far more worse if it happens in any data center server or some kind of you know cp so uh, the various uh, scenarios can be tested uh, with the packet generator so my objective is to have a framework like uh, toffee data center uh, wherein uh, you don't have any uh, ip address associated with the ports at the same time please understand if you don't have ip address always this is something a question always i get uh, whether toffee data center works like a transparent bridge like linux bridge or something it is not the case at all it it works like a transparent bridge but it is not strictly a transparent Uh, linux bridge as well so this is what it's a complete uh, you know custom architecture or framework which i have done and it it doesn't fully work like a transparent bridge so similarly this is not uh, a transparent bridge uh, i want to do uh, a sort of a network uh, you know uh, packet generation uh, source uh, and uh, as well as you can also have a, a you know sync 
where you can connect two ends uh, you can as a, uh, use it uh, uh, as it is like a source and sink where you can get uh, these packets getting generated at one end it will be sent across to the other end and by whatsoever means if you send any uh, wrong packets uh, for the ports which the other end is not listening you will never get any kind of you know error messages back and forth so this is something happens quite common if you send any random udp packets you may get some icmp unreachable and of that destination unreachable uh, you know reply packet so this is what is the undesired uh, uh, effect when you need certain you know test cases you just need to send the packets you don't need any kind of you know reply from the other end so this is the actual objective of making this uh, packet generator tool and uh, Uh, with this we will have that uh, precise control uh, we can adjust the rate uh, and if you are uh, working uh, uh Uh, scenarios like uh, vpn you can test the performance if you are working scenarios like uh, in my case uh, toffee data center uh, van optimization or van acceleration any such scenarios you can uh, uh, test uh, without uh, toffee data center how is your network uh, performance characteristics and with toffee data center or any other van acceleration tools uh, how it is uh, you know performing uh, with that you know uh, deployment in place so various uh, you know scenarios we can test with the same and of course you can obviously test with real data i'm not denying that but this test data which can give you that precise playback control and uh, with that you can uh, do a sort of you know precise playback you can always repeat a test scenario with the precise amount of data just not uh, it is not something uh, just possible with uh, uh, a, you know uh simple uh, you know some kind of desktop uh, connected with some remote uh, server or something and then you do some file download or something like that so each time due to various uh, you know situations uh, it is going to change but in this case uh, since it is a pure synthetic traffic it is not going to affect any kind of uh you know dynamic performance so i'm keeping this uh, tool name uh, or the you know project name as uh, toffee fudge Uh, because uh, the fudge itself is like a mixture of several things you may have chocolate base with uh, various other things uh, like uh, you know fruits and nuts and uh, you know uh, rice crisps and other stuff you know put together so similarly uh, toffee fudge also represents uh, sending uh, a mixture of um, uh, you know uh, assorted uh, packets uh, Uh, through that you know test tool so this way it is easy to remember toffee mocha is always associated with uh, uh, van emulation or van simulation versus uh, toffee uh, fudge the new upcoming tool which i am uh, designing the same i have also told about this in couple of my videos that i am working uh, from past couple of weeks or more than that uh, on a couple of other uh, projects and i was busy with the same because every time i do uh, tests with the toffee data center i feel something it is lacking i have tried even uh, some online uh, packet generation tools but still i feel this is a moment where i feel i need to generate my own tool with that i will have that precise control i know exactly what is happening in the network and then i can refine and then i can have that uh, you know predictability of you know toffee data center operation as well so this is what it is a uh, good to have something like this in the existing ecosystem uh, where uh, if any uh, oems or you know vendors uh, make their products they will also uh, have a tool like this uh, and with that they can even test in their real uh, deployments in their real production networks as well so i may do this uh, uh, release of uh, toffee fudge the new toffee fudge uh, sometime around april or may uh, 2018 uh, i may do uh, in the form of iso package so that it is ready to use out of box you can immediately take out of box and uh, you can uh, as soon as you download the same you can immediately uh, you know run on your uh, physical uh, devices or else uh, virtual devices as it is and in case if it is some kind of you know tarp or source you need to either compile or else you need to just install various uh, dependencies the big problem is i use uh, 
a wide assortment of dependencies that always includes as you know mysql again apache with mysql php and php the entire lamp installation and apart from that various other components so this is nowhere uh, i'm interested to give at another uh, you know release steps and stuff like that like i'm avoiding these days it is going to be a, a direct uh, ready to use out of box iso package and the similar thing i may do with the uh, toffee mocha in the future as well so with this i would like to conclude this video in case if you have anything to discuss uh, you can be in touch via mail thank you once again for watching this video stay tuned have a nice day bye bye